close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. I don't want to waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading us. And love is all we'll ever trust. Yeah. No, I don't want to waste what's left. And love. What can I do for you? Done! Deposit box 256. Last you on the right. What the hell's this, Chenfinelli? Box is empty. Well, uh, coins got to circulate. So when we learned you were dead, Master, we, uh, circulated yours. Purchased stocks, bonds, invested in a few vineyards. Before we knew it, there was hee-haw left in the box. Really ought to call it what it is. You robbed me, plain and simple. Nay, Master Witcher, never! I wouldn't dare! Oh, you'd dare. And now you'll answer for it. Open the gate. Master Witcher, I'll pay it all back, every red copper. I swear it on my nana's beard. Fooled me once, not about to let you fool me again. Master Geralt, I beg you, keep your heat. We can work this out, I know we can. Rip that coin out of your throat if I have to. Guards! Help! Shut for that light! Come here! Ah! 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 Ah!
Are you, pal? Oh. Oh. Hmm, a key. Get my hands on that quit. I, Marianne, close the account and pay the man his coin. Thank you. Master Witcher, your coin. Just don't go making any mere trouble, all right? This it? Expected a few thousand at least. Well, there's things to account for. Taxes, inflation... <clears throat> ah, and Master Witcher, one more thing. Don't come back to my bank ever again. Can do without patrons like you. Get out, that's your Oh! At your service, Richard. Can't believe it. Damsel's demand. My friend, it's just common just knowledge from Bino Nero Hills, the best sweet Lay about wonks, sluggards, sky. You, Jacob? Heal, Mohot, now! Who asks? A witcher. Saw you notice. Hold up. A witcher, you say? Like in Lewis Herrera's tales and fables. Luckier than a green, bleeding leprechaun I am. See? Not a soul around believes this tree is Daphne. The cursed lady of legend. But you, you could lift the curse. Bit too old to believe in bedtime stories, aren't you? Want your chops busted, Witcher? How old I am, that is none of your porking concern. Fair point. Not my business what you believe. Ha! Huh. I'm content we see eye to eye.
So what makes you think there's a girl cursed inside the tree? What? My jaw dropped in the dirt. But right then I knew. Don't tell me. From Herrera's tales and... You porking bet. Second edition. I meant it in Octavo. I know those tales by heart. My nan read them to put me to sleep. Guess she read it cover to cover, colophon included. Got me curious, gotta admit. You really think the old tales are true? Taking the weepy, are you? Do you think me bore me? No, it's just these are dark, grim times. No room for nights pure of heart or happily ever afters. So I don't often run into folk like you. Yes, true, the times are crud, Pai. Uh, but I see this as all the more reason to rip. My gran would say, if you know not what to do, think to the chessboard knight and noble Alondra. And she schooled me so thorough in it, I could not do otherwise even if I wished to. Let me take a look. Careful now. Gods be bum poked. Well, what did you learn? I swear I hear sobs in the rustling leaves. Logger was making good time. Strange though. Willows isolated. No other trees near it. Actually does bleed. Looks like human blood too. And the bark resembles hypertrophic scars in places. Medallions humming like crazy. Intense magic at work here. Blood. Seeped from the direction of the tree, judging by the shape of the stain. And? Did you look at the tree close? Mm-hmm. Actually does bleed. Pretty incredible. Looks wondrous. Did I not say so? My help doesn't come free, you know. You speak to a lowly woodcutter. No stench of... Agreed. I will pay. Willing to help, but first I gotta figure- No need. I know it all. Miss Daphne and Sir Gareth shared a terrible and fearsome laugh before Sir Gareth set off for the hill. Miss Daphne gave him her kerchief, a token of her favor. Let me guess, he never returned. He did not. She stood- Till she sprouted roots and turned into a tree? I will fecking tell you why. To await them. So you must Take it easy.
torches. or trophies. Arrow, broken in half. No doubt to bring bad luck to the archer. Branch off a grapevine. Could be to ensure a good harvest, or a bad one. Doll looks like an accessory for casting curses. Chief, monogrammed DF. Hmm. Could use it to break the curse if it's Daphne's. None but feral cats stray in here most oft, yet it seems I've forgessed from afar at that. What do you seek in my home? <clears throat> Already found it. You do not aim to lift the curse from the tree, girl, do you? What if I do? Then you had best know you waste your time. The old tales? Did your nan not tell them to you? The Lady's Knight, you ever- Sir Gareth. Yes. He came to so He stayed a fair while. Then his conscience... He might have resolved to, but never made it. A tragic fate befell him along the way. You have anything to do with this, Turner? Of course. Was I to let... What if I asked you nicely to lift the curse? Gareth met the fate he deserved. And what happened to his witch was not... Right, so you didn't cast the curse, but could you help lift it? I probably could, but why ever would I? I'll humble myself, prostrate myself before you like the Gareth of the Tale did. I beseech you to help me. Lift the curse that imprisoned Daphne in the tree. When I saw you enter my hut, I thought, not stand. None, not even I can restore to the last the yes she has lost, can erase the suffering she has endured. We cannot bring her back to life, but I shall tell you how you might let her depart in peace. Yet my aid shall have its price. A lock of your hair? <sighs> How can I know you won't use it to cast a spell on me? I require this. I must, for with it I will cast a spell to conceal me from you for all time, and will use it for nothing else. You will nag me never again, and you've nothing to fear, I assure you. I always keep my word.
I'll trust you against my better judgment. Lock of my hair's yours. Splendid. What do I need to do? You must convince the maiden her beloved Jan to return, but perished in the attempt. Take her silk kerchief and a fragment of Gareth's remains. His bones lie bleaching in the cave beneath this rock. Fire must consume the kerchief and remain. Yeah. Thanks for your help. You're welcome. And adieu.
find some bones. Gareth's remains? These them? Wonder why the armor came apart. Magic? Or he just gotta get back to the tree, lift the curse. So, you met the witch, you must. That witch made me bow and scrape, sure. Joyous, bleeding news, but what about... I can lift the curse, free her. But we gotta start at the right time. When the hour comes, I'll light four fires for the four winds. Then begin the ritual. Fires? Then I shall be of use to you after all. Seems you need wood. Much of it. Chop as much as you can. I'll... I've chopped and stacked the wood. What now? My turn. Gotta light fires and talk to the woman enchanted in the tree. No idea how this will turn out, so just in case, stand at a distance. And if you see me draw my sword, run. Look your last to the world's four winds. From the south, not a word. East, no cry is heard. From the north, silence sighs. From the west, hear hollow eyes. Cease your vigil, dead he lies. The day of your freedom has come. Behold a kerchief, proof of your love for another. Behold, a bone of he to whom you offered your love. return no he won't is his love for me gone did he stay true
Gareth remained faithful to the end of his days. The time comes that I depart. I've waited too long. I've suffered. Farewell, lady. I thank you, stranger. And you, my knight. I did not think it would end this way. I hoped we could revive her, but I guess it won't. We did all we could. You did well. Thanks. Take care of yourself. So long, Witcher. Job this like a lady. You can always get a new one. Faster. How the hell I can walk on that water? Naturally, I know. Since time immemorial have I dwelt in solitude on this shore, and I can testify to the extraordinary nature of the lake. What's so extraordinary about it? I mean, besides the fact that you can walk on its surface. A sword, most wondrous, lies in its depths. I watch over it. The blade may be grasped solely by one who possesses the five chivalric virtues. Folk call me a lot of things, but virtuous? I don't know. Yet I... You have proven yourself capable of great sympathy. You are a... Of humble means yourself. You show generosity to others. Your va reason guides your actions, as it does though you have proven the five chivalric virtues dwell in your heart. You mean the sword's mine? I can dive in and take it? The sword deserves the hand of a master. Anytime.
You have proven worthy of wielding the blade. Beyond all doubt. Behold, your Arendite. We've met before. Certainly. The Hermit admitted he knew you, remember? The Lady of the Lake. It is I. Forget not that you are a man right and honorable, devoted to doing good. And for these reasons you received the blade. Now bear it. And I trust this time you shall not lose it. My eyes were not deceived, yet so far south. You, sir, of all folk in all your fame. Mm-hmm. Me, south in all. Ah, oh, I've heard so much. Why, oh, when Master Dandelion... <laughs> yeah, and welcome little... Ah, oh, you see... Mm. Couldn't have gotten you a bouquet, some sweets and a... Witcher, sir, you jest. But alas... Rarely my want. Ah, naturally. Why, you, sir, are no knight errant, but a guildsman. Yes, that a. 
This Grattore. Know anything else about it, mademoiselle? Judge it. Yes. Hmm. Nocturnal. Um. Francois claimed he would... Do... I forget you come from afar and do not know. That close to the... Quite the contrary. I see. Please, no, you don't tarry not. Tarry tomorrow. I beg you. A night. I must wait. Oh, wait. Did our hairdressers like this, Trula? Not free for anyone willing what? to play what? this. I assure you, Skelliger is just as strong as the other factions. I don't know. Always been an Ilfgaard. Geralt of Rivia saw a notice about a Gwent tournament. By all means, you've come to the. Our tourney's more than mere diversion. We've a mission, see, to spread word of my brother's brainchild, Skelliger, a new Gwent faction. These new cards. Tell me something about them. Their design embodies the Isle's spirit. The rage-filled potency. The rough, brutal beauty. Famed Skelligers, heroes of lore, berserkers and beasts. Ogolas from the cards. Bran Twir. And the other famous Skelligers? Yalmar. New deck? Where to get the idea? I mean, why bother? All Beauclair knows. We shared another great passion. Travel. Spent a great... The stormy sea. Consumed by a fever. A suicidal orb. Dashing itself against somber cliffs. The tournament. Right here with me. You see, I've already asked a great many seasoned players to do the same. Alas... Long story short, you need a sucker. We understand one another. Behold this trophy. Stand. Mm, not bad. Oh. That is an ex... Just... No chance I can win. An issue e... Here, the cards I... Doth one no. Sloth doth one go... Clearly, we're not born in a bar.
Spoon like this. When you set a place, where's it go? My, oh my. It seems rather a fanciful bouillon spoon. Or a key of some sort. Yeah, note led me here. Any idea what the key might open? Never seen it before. But you might search the cellars. The previous owner left all sorts of knick-knack. Eat, drink, and be merry. Brilliant. Just take the profit. Art is not like bread and butter, but it's fruit and... Good. Ah. I wish you health. Proceed you when I think ah. of those days of your air fate had bound my life to Here is the hero we can afford. Witcher, open the unbeliever's eyes. Welcome home, sir. I am Barnabas Basil Fauti. By order of the Duchess, I shall serve you as Major Domo of Corfo Bianco. I previously served with distinction at the Nibli family manor and in Nazaire with Admiral Rompali, who, as you are certain to know, is an extraordinary demanding gentleman. Whoa, Barnabas Basil. One thing you ought to know, I'm not your typical landed gentleman. Truth be told, this is the first real property I've ever owned. Oh, in that case, you must leave it all to me. I shall organize, see to everything, and whip the house into order. Great. Can already see I'm in good hands. Vineyard comes across as a place with Baron Rossell, who went bankrupt, forcing him to sell the estate to the Duchess. The Baron, in turn, had purchased it from Monsieur Bolius of the Headsman, a truly colorful man of Ketweni origin. He was actually a headsman? He never hesitated, not once. Never sliced unevenly, never botched a job. For his exemplary service, the Duke granted him a title and this estate. Monsieur Bolius, on the other hand, was an engineer. Sadly, misfortune struck and he lost his sense first of smell, then of taste. Additionally, he could not drink alcohol. Shame that. Not at all. He made even more of it. Began throwing wild balls. Mind giving me a little tour? Not in the least. Follow me, please. I think it would be practical to begin on the hill. Behold, sir, your estate in all its splendor. Pretty vast. Indeed. And now, sir, allow me to show you a handful of interesting details. Follow me, please. Been a major domo all your life? Yes, I come from a long line of major domos. My father was a major domo, as was my grandfather before him, as was my great aunt. In fact, she was the one to start the tradition. Great aunt? A hard woman. If 
It is said that already as a child, she knew where she was going and went there. When she arrived in Beauclair, she signed on as a chambermaid at one of the vineyards, then slowly worked her way up to Major Domo. She dragged the rest of the family up the same path. The servants' quarters. I occupy the green home. With the Duchess's permission, I have hired a full staff. Their salaries to be paid from the Ducal Treasury. Nice of her. Not the most sightly part of the estate, I admit. But I think it's worthwhile for you as master of the domain to know where the help stands. Baron Rossell ordered the vines in this part of the estate uprooted and olive groves planted in their place. They look beautiful, especially come spring. Don't look at all bad now, either. Down below lies your vineyard, where we grow a strain of Carfanere, one of the world's oldest. Aged in oak barrels, it provides for an exquisite wine with distinct blackberry, wild cherry, plum, and cinnamon notes. Marvelous. I have to try it one of these days. <laughs> You've spread some nastiness to me. The days pass. The pile of work. Nice well. Picturesque. Yes, though it ran dry long ago. During the raucous feasts Master Bolius held, he would order it filled with wine. There's a tale about a guest attending a Bolius spoon for the first time and thus unaware of the custom. He had suffered great heartbreak and had decided to end his life by jumping into the well. The festivities were coming to a close and the well was nearly empty when the suicidal guest finally jumped. Instead of killing himself, he nearly broke his legs. To numb the pain, he drank the wine. Drank himself to death? N not at all. When found the next day, he had concluded he'd witnessed twin miracles. The water had been changed into wine, and he had survived. He retired to a monastery in the Dragon Mountains and began preaching the wisdoms of Lebioda. Monsieur Bolius's wife, Nina, kept a garden here. A supremely lovely place it was. Bit neglected now. I agree. Yet nothing stands in the way of restoring it to its former glory, and once again planting it with herbs and other vegetation. Madame Nina planted diminutive, delicate flowers and herbs here. One might say their aroma still hangs in the air. You're quite the romantic, Barnabas Basil. This served as an additional wine cellar in years of plentiful harvests. Hmm. Bit of work and it'll make a fine stable for Roach. If my lips don't stink of wine, my wife won't know they're mine! Women and chaps, the more you beat them, the better they are! The cellars, voila! 
During Monsieur Bolis's time, wine was kept here, but Baron Rossel used it to store olive oil as well. I took the liberty of cleaning up the mess, which I made while fighting the Bruxa. Thanks, Barnabas Basil. Appreciate it. Living man's chops. The more you beat them, the better they are. As you can see, the facade is, to put it, slightly stained. But one cannot deny a certain subtle southern charm. True, though it could use a bit of subtle paint. the master bedroom. On the right, the dining hall and kitchen. Upstairs, you shall find the guest room, currently used for storage. Not a bad idea. At the moment, the house is only minimally furnished. Yet I believe we will, together, devise some innovative arrangements. A few paintings, for instance, would breathe new life into the abode immediately. With that, sir, you've seen the full lay of the land. Corfo Bianco is a beautiful estate. Though one must admit, Time. If, if, forgive me for being forward, but if... Think I'll take you up on that. Be sh Mentioned the place could stand to be spr... Almost decidedly, sir. Quest... Been thinking about the outer walls. Maybe a fresh... If I might dare to make a suggestion... Why not stop? Not only did the residents positively sparkle up. It's in your hands then. Make the place. I shall get to work imme- Highly skilled at what they- Is- Got these spacious- Oh, yes! The way I- My armor needs work from time. Admiral Rompali once hired a specialist who made the... Good. Order me up a table like that. Immediately, sir. I expect... Will you be needing any... In my trade, my blades get... Of course. No... Then send out for one, please. Of course. I shall send out. Will you be need? Now what? I shall be glad. Then. How might I be up? Starting to real. I agree.
elevations coming along all superb in other news, the lab If you say I should at one time. Maybe. No anything of a laboratory. It is. It was walled up. Whoever it was sure knew. Forgive me. It's just saying. It's top notch equipment. Then I am all the more del. Starting to really. As you wish, sir. Feels. Indeed. Momentum is best maintained once established. Now that we finished the general renovations. You might begin to consider such... Was wondering about the gastro- Oh, but that is immaterial. All self-respecting- hmm. I understand. Thinking about- Excellent idea. <clears throat> I understand. Let's put not the slightest problems. Drink! Give me a drink! <laughs> Ah, oh. don't push.
Ooh. You scared me off to death, Drifter. What do they call you? What's your crest? Speak! Geralt of Rivia, crest of the bridge. Hail and well met. I... well indeed, for... Hmm... by... I have tarried a bit, true, but the delay is done. Wouldn't happen. I... I don't know. After all, I... Deposit the beast's head at your beloved's feet. All in all, I... I should be the one to lop off its head. We gotta kill it first. Mm, strange. No sign of Kratori. Massive. You'd think you were in a winter garden. The brute is not here. We cannot change this. We must live with it. Desist.
come by my troth the damned brute was sturdy i i'm grateful witcher you ate at me greatly why the challenge couldn't have gone after something less formidable uh, why you're blushing sir oh it's my so i bowed to slay gratori for... mm -hmm. especially High time you return to Beauclair, Brie. Nay, oh, nay. The head of this beast is in. The world awaits. Thanks, Master. Take it easy. <laughs> ah, if only I could afford that horse for my son. Good news. You're betrothed. Is my betrothed no more? What? He was just here. Well, at least he chose some... Precisely. I told him I require no more proof. It is... <sighs> Good chunk of them, I'm afraid. 
I should have joined a priestess's room. But what care have you for my... Forgive me, please. I'm in no need. at least did with her others. Greetings. A witcher from the school of the wolf here in Tucson. Greetings. Geralt of Rivia seem pretty. Brother, mind you, it's no monster hunt, but I'm sure you'll be interested all the same. I'm an armorer, see, and I... Heard of him? Not quite, for I've been lucky enough to learn that their holders came to Tucson. If you know where to look. No offense, but do I look like a rough-hewn adventurer? No, I... What do you have? Would you craft something for me? Oh.
All these diagrams somehow wound up into... Tusa was once home to Tiensail, a legendary and now deceased elfin master armorer. Witches from all corn... Heard about him. And thus he charged the king's ransom for his work. Witches would take diff... Got it. Find them? As it happens, I learned my trade. What he told me. We must strike a deal. I... This elven master... My father forged armor. As a youngster, I helped. Only now, years on, do I realize the honor that... Alas, my master perished in a massacre later, slain by racists. Though he taught... I know I have no equal in the trade. Yet, uh, until I complete Witcher armor of... Where do I look for these diagrams? I know of five likely fallen... Tell me about my brother, the wolf. His name was Aton. I remember him well. My master liked him. A few years ago, an archaeological expedition arrived in Toussaint from Castel Gropia. They questioned my master about the elfin ruins at Ter... What kind of danger did he mean? Any idea? Legend claims wraiths haunt the chambers beneath Termas. The Griffin. What can you tell me about him? He came some 200 years ago, but my master remembered him well. This he showed my master his diagrams, paid a deposit, and was never seen again. Apparently. Any idea where he went? No. It said he left in a rush, so he may have left something behind. Oh. Let's talk about the cat. A year ago, Bartolome de Lorne, the ducal armorer, asked me to confirm... You see, at the time he was working on... The diagram you saw. Was it really a Witcher diagram? Yup, possibly a well-founded fear. Soon after, de Lorne disappeared... Tell me more about the bear, can you? He appeared shortly after Master Tien Sail took me on as his apprentice. <laughs> True, this one clearly was not wealthy. Time passed, the bear never showed, and my ma- School of the Manticore. Probably know the least about it, though once long ago. My master? He made a poor impression on my... Tien Sahil slammed the... The Witcher, however, failed to return. Bastoy prison, where he was held. Fair Good luck on the... Surfeit of you beauty. Are reminded that by decision of the city council, you are requesting long to live to her grace. Three cheers for two songs. Nothing to see here. Move along. Those noises again. I couldn't sleep a week.
run, Roach.
building. Foundations probably caved in. Literally undermined. Beaver, booger me. was hunting. Doesn't seem like he killed it. Gotta keep my eyes peeled.
got the shivers. Not so fast, Roach. Slow now. It's enough to drive you betty. Run, Roach. Cave entrance. Let's see if this Witcher left any tracks. symbol on the wall. Clever. Gotta keep a lookout for more. Damn, you're ugly. Symbol on the wall. Clever. Gotta keep a lookout for more. Left his school symbol on the wall. Clever. Gotta keep a lookout for more. <laughs> <laughs> 